Hi, everybody. It's, uh, it's one o'clock. It is now time for some fantastic Ask Jason Griffiths absolutely anything in the house. Griffiths. That's right. There's no S.
Like my director, whenever the line is meant to be cocky, he'll say, do it full of cock. <laughs> um, yeah, oh, it's, it's, ton, it's tons of fun. I mean, the biggest challenge with doing something like that is, um, is pacing yourself. Because when we do video games, sometimes we'll do like six hours a day. And that's a lot of screaming. You know, so they're good about giving us breaks and everything, but at the end of the day, you're totally shot. You really have to watch how you're projecting, but you can lose, lose it, you know. Um, but unfortunately, I've never had to, like, cancel a session due to being sick or confusing my voice. You know. it's, it's great. It's awesome. You know. And also, a lot of people love Sonic, you know, so we're always hoping to do better and better each time, so you know, we have a really good product. I, you know, since we haven't mentioned that in the last panel, but yeah, six hours would be, that is a very long voiceover session. And I think most people who go, you know, to a regular job that are there for eight hours would think, oh, six hours is not a bad day. But I, you know, six hours if you're, you know, sitting at a desk at a computer is, is not that bad. But if you have to, like, be 100% full of energy and moving and yelling, and yes. it's draining. Oh yeah, because they, they want you to be at performance level every, you know, it's not, you can't like have a few lines, oh, you know, I'm tired here, no, everything has to be at the same level, or higher, you know. But it's necessary to do these really long reports for the games because uh, uh, the Sonic team flies in from San Francisco to Japan, and they're only there for, you know, Friday through Sunday. So if you don't get it done, that's a well. It has to be done. Yeah. Questions? What has it been like working for Sega? Oh, Sega is great. I, I've met so many people from um, through the years of doing the games, and everybody's been more than great. And they, the directors really know what they want. You know, it's funny. Um, we sometimes have uh, we'll have a director who's Japanese but he speaks English, and then like two producers that don't speak English. So they'll, if they have an idea about something, they'll act it out, they'll be you know, speaking Japanese to one another. I have no idea what they're doing. And I remember one day, I did a line once, and uh, the director was sitting down, and then he, like this, and then he got up out of his chair, and I can't hear anything they're saying, because I'm going to sound real good, but he looks at the director and starts going, <laughs> the, director, the director pushed the talk back button. He's like, he wants you to do it faster. <laughs> so in that in that sense, it's, it's very entertaining. You know? You see lost in translation. Yes. Yeah. 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 that that is it? Yes. Oh, sure, yeah. I, um, I don't usually give them away. But, you know, I don't have a... I have a Super Nintendo and a regular Nintendo. I don't, I don't have any of the, the next-gen consoles. You know, so if they give me games, I usually give them to my, my little brother who has consoles. You know. And they send me t-shirts, stickers, and all sorts of cool stuff. You know? Place the <laughs> Really understands that that's what has to happen. You know? If I'm 
being Sonic falling from a ledge, you know, I, I can't just stand there and go, ah, you know, you really have to like, you know, let loose what you can.